Hold on, one more. I mean, how many married couples would say, can you take a picture of me whilst I reach for the bonbons and my husband grins like an idiot underneath? Please, Craig, this is from our honeymoon period, the first day I worked at the shop. Would you take the flaming picture, Craig? It's harder than it looks standing like this. It's the police. Hello? I'm going to the pub. You lock up. You do know it's fraud what you're doing. Well, it's only a competition, just a little fib. You're deliberately telling lies to get your hand on some big prize. In my book, that's fraud. Yes, well, you're more au fait than we are with the criminal element. Is that a crack about Jenny? I, I thought he meant Dennis. No, I meant Gemma. I mean, you must admit it is a bit of a rogues gallery. You can get down now. Oh, oh thank goodness. goodness. My hamstring was giving me jip. Everything OK? Yeah, fine. I know. One more for luck. My knees are killing me. Do you want some more? Would you two shush, please? Say cheese. Cheese! Ah, that should do it. Oh. I'm going to get off, Mary, if that's OK. Yes, we're finished. Thanks, Bethany. Why are we doing this again? Well, like I said, it's just a project Norris and I are working on. So why don't you two go upstairs and get changed quickly before your father comes home, and then we'll we'll take down the tree. Yeah, but well, well, why, why were they in the photo? Uh, I mean, who are they supposed to be? Our kids, our grandkids, or what? Or the bloke from the corner shop's kids. Yeah. Well, that's just the point. It's enigmatic. The mystery might just give us the edge when they're choosing who goes through to the next round. What did the police want earlier? They didn't say. DC Lee's coming round later. Do you want me to be there with you? Do you think Rita's right? Is it fraud to pretend that we're married? I mean, maybe we should think about getting married for real. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, the, the law loves a fake marriage, doesn't it? Ask Maria. Oh, but that was different. They lived in different cities. I mean, he was gay, for goodness sake. <laughs> I mean, you and I have known each other for years, and would it be so difficult to believe that we, um, that we, uh, might have fallen in love? Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it would be. <sighs> Norris, this prize means I get to see my son. My grandson. I can't afford to get to South Africa otherwise. You, you want us to get married legally just to win a competition? Oh, no, no, no. You want your head examining. Well, what about Emily in Peru? You were desperate to see her. Well, I am, yeah, but... I, I've got to win this prize, Norris. We both do. We can't risk disqualification. <clears throat> Norris Cole, will you marry me? Oh, I must be mad, but oh, okay. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> They're still locked up, aren't they? There's no chance that they could get released. No, none at all. I come with good news. Oh, thank you. So, the oh. investigating officers have found laptops and phones belonging to Neil, which establish a connection between him and Nathan. There's logs of calls, texts, photos, all sorts. Have the CPS got involved? They've authorised charges, yes. Will they have to testify at trial? Uh, it depends if they plead guilty or not. I don't know if I can face him again. If they don't plead guilty, there's special measures we can put in place, like a, a video link, so you wouldn't have to see him again. You are the bravest person I know. And I'll be with you every step of the way. Do you hear me? 